Hi everybody and welcome back. I've got a slightly different episode for you today. I'm going to be having a more talky episode whilst I build something interesting. Yay. <coughs> Excuse me. Sorry, I'm just eating some crisps. <laughs> Bad idea. When am I actually going to learn that I should maybe not eat or drink before I do this? So, yeah. I've got a nice big fence thing here. What do you think I'm building? Um, yeah, so may as well say this. This is now my eighth attempt to trying to make this episode because I keep cocking up and making lots and lots of mistakes. So yeah, so hopefully this one goes okay. And if you're seeing it, yay! If you're not seeing it, then that's another one I've cocked up. <laughs> yeah, so what we're going to be talking about this episode is we're going to be talking about the independence stuff that's happening in Scotland just now. For those who don't know, Scotland is holding a refer referendum on whether or not to remain as part of the UK or to leave it. Um, so basically there's two sort of sides. There's yes to leave it, which is uh, led by Alex Salmond who is the Scottish Prime Minister basically oh I took the wrong one shit no 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 oh, no that's it yeah he's basically the Scottish Prime Minister and the leader of No Campaign which is uh, basically better together is Alistair Darling, who is the ex-Chancellor of the Shaker, which is basically the guy who was in control of all the money. So they had the, the first uh, televised debate last night. I unfortunately had to record it because I had more important things to do, which was to go watch football match. <laughs> yeah, I went and watched my my team beat our sort of rivals, so that was good. And the Scottish. Diddy Cup match, I've forgotten what it was called it changes the name every three years it's one of those trophies so yeah, so I basically recorded it and then me and my dad sat and watched it when we were eating our tea tonight, so yeah, so basically some of the points that were raised were what currency we would be using, education uh, income budget deficit stuff like that I keep going, yeah. Um, oil money and generally stuff like that stuff that normally gets brought up at every single basically general election and stuff like that so excuse me, just scratch my head so the independence, the actual vote takes place in about 6 weeks time uh, 6 weeks time on the 18th of September I will be voting of course, as I am of age. Um, for this is, you can actually, you actually only have to be a, I need to get this bit right, this is the bit I've been getting wrong, so don't worry if I go really quiet, oh, 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 oh somebody's, somebody's speaking to me on Facebook, hopefully you didn't hear that, <laughs> oops, I forgot I've left, uh, I've got my, Google Chrome open. I should be right. Yes, right. Hold on. Oh, I may have just cracked this. Then is it? No, 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 no. Do I do this bit? No, do I not do this bit? No. I forgot what what I do now. Oh, oh no, 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 no. He, he, he. Doesn't tell me what. My instructions are shite. Ah, ah, ah! I don't know what to do this bit. I think I go one, two, yeah, three. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, yes, yes, cracked it, cracked it. Right. Hopefully, I actually might finish this one. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yes, 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 yes. Let's just make sure I've done it right. 
Or is it two? No, 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 no. Oh, hold on. I've done this wrong. This will be one, two. One, two. Boom. Boom. That should hopefully be okay. <laughs> yeah, hopefully this will be alright. <laughs> this is just going as bad as the rest, but hey, oh. Yeah, so I will be voting. I've already decided what I'm voting. Currently, it's about. I can't remember what last, last night's poll was because we skipped over that bit. I think it's about 46% yes, 41%. Sorry, say that again. 48% no, and 48%. A 1% yes, and then there's some undecided voters uh, as per usual. Um, one, two. Yeah, this is going a lot better than originally. Yeah, so um, so that's so currently no votes currently winning, which has sort of been the case sort of since the referendum sort of got announced about two years ago. Now I think it was two years ago. God. I don't know how long ago it was. It must have been two years ago. Yeah, I assume it's two years ago that it got announced. So it sort of stayed very stable, to be entirely honest. And it's sort of been lots and lots of undecided answers. But there's generally sort of a couple of things which most Scottish people who are probably voting, some voting yes and some voting no, would actually agree with. And let's go up there. That was wrong. They are that. Generally, people want more power to be held in Scotland. Um, Scotland has its own parliament, basically, uh, even though we're generally governed by the UK government. So basically what happens is Scottish can make up changed laws that are made in England. One quite recent example is the bedroom tax, and Scottish Parliament basically allowed the local councils to change that. Oh, oh, oh shit. I know, I know, fine, I'm, like, I'm on the right colour. Um, to change that, so pay the bedroom tax where you get tax on any extra bedrooms you have in your house that are unoccupied if you're in a council ta house. So basically, the Scottish Government, the English, the UK, sorry, Government brought that in at Westminster and the Scottish Government changed that, so that's sort of what happens. Whereas if the Scottish made a law, the English can't then change it. I don't know. It's see whenever I refer to English I mean Westminster. It's just gonna be far too long me correcting myself each time. Because I'm probably gonna do it quite a lot. Um yeah, so that's kind of the general stuff that's happened. If you would want an in-depth video of this, I recommend watching CGP Great. Uh, he does lots of especially his early videos, there's a lot on about sort of this kind of thing. So if you want a more detail about how the Scottish how the UK Parliament works, I would highly recommend watching that. Don't need that yet, don't need that yet. Yeah. So even though I s I'm voting no, I do believe Scotland could actually be become independent. However I think it would only be a short term thing because it would be too reliant on money in the oil industry which is the North Sea stuff, which I think we were going to run out of very soon and which won't be a very good thing because then we become poor again basically. <laughs> so I want oh oh shit 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 I forgot this bit. Hold on, I've got this bit. I need to do six. We do six. That one, two, three there we go. So it's one, two, three, one, two, three. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two. Yes! I actually I'm on track to finish this this time. Yes. Oof. Oh if I was panicking there. Two, three, four. Yeah, so I forgot what I was saying. What was I saying? What on earth was I saying? Oil. Yeah, so I base I think Scotland could do it, but we'd run out of money because we have quite an aging population here and we wouldn't be able to fund it and that's a point that uh, Alistair, Alistair Darling made last night. However, of course, Alex Salmond 
sort of glossed over that as per usual. Um, yeah, so although many people said we couldn't do it, I think it's generally accepted now that we could do it. Yeah, that's fine. Um, other points that we raised was the currency. Basically, what's come out and said is that if Scotland does get independent, it can't use sterling, of which Alex Salmon said we are using it, and Alistair Darling's like we're not using it, and it's just creating more and more uncertainty, which is a never, never, it's never a good thing. One, two, three, four. Oh my god, I might actually finish this. <laughs> um, yeah, so that was quite a live, that was quite the, like, one of the livelier parts of the debate actually, quite interesting bits. Generally because Alistair Darling is trying to get an answer out of probably the best person ever not to answer the question. On, on so me and my dad were sitting watching it going, wow, he doesn't answer a single question but he's very good at it. Uh, talking about Salmon here. Salmon? Uh, Alex Salmon. Um, yeah, so from so yeah, so that was generally what was discussed last night. People are mainly saying that Alistair Darrell and Darlin won the vote, but it's to be honest, they made the very good point of saying uh, there's only one poll that really counts, and that's the one in a couple of weeks' time. But I hope you've been able to work out what I've been doing. It's quite a simple. Thing. That's it, that's it, right, oh, I don't have torches, so I'm going to have to come back up and light this, because mobs are probably going to spawn in it. Yeah, so, what have I built? Oh, what have I built? What have I built? I'm just, also, I'm so happy right now that I've actually managed to finish building this. This is generally my eighth attempt to try to build this, and for me to actually finish this. So good. And I overestimated on how much I needed, but hey yo, I thought I might do Brawl splash. Yeah, so this is what I have done. Da da. Alright, well, I'll take down the scaffolding and stuff like that, and I'll obviously remove the sandpaper. So that's my Scotland flag. So hopefully you've enjoyed this episode. If you've got any points you would like to add into the description, I'd be feeling much appreciate what your views are and stuff like that and have a nice discussion in the comments. Anyway, thanks for watching and bye bye.